Hello, my name is Dr. Jennifer Klemp. I'm a professor of medicine in the Division of Medical Oncology at the University of Kansas Cancer Center, and I also work for Keras Life Sciences. The importance of thinking about cancer survivors as the whole person allows us to think about their lifestyle, movement, diet, and really getting them back to what they want their baseline to be. I think that one thing that's very important is to help patients set expectations, and lifestyle tends to be one of those um, activities where they can be part of it, and, and really they're kind of um, part of their care team. And so by giving patients and survivors those options, to eat a healthy lifestyle, try to keep moving even during treatment. Um, it may be limited, but we need it to keep moving in a, a kind of a safe and, and um, purposeful way. Um, and trying to eat foods that really recharge us and, and energize us are important. I think it's interesting that some patients, especially breast cancer survivors or um, some of our GYN cancer survivors, they tend to gain weight both during and post-treatment. So it's really important for us to also focus on the importance of, of staying sort of weight neutral during treatment and then maybe doing some purposeful weight loss um, once treatment has completed. Um, but I think the important part of, of thinking about the whole patient is that means we do need to think about um, the other pieces that maybe are not within our scope of practice, but are vitally important to patients recovery. And therefore, I think we need to, to think about the community that we need to have to support those survivors, whether that be experts in dietetics and nutrition, whether that be, um, uh, you know, physical therapists or occupational therapists who specialize in, in patients with a, a diagnosis of cancer. Those are important people to have on our team so we can empower our patients, hopefully engage them as early as possible. And that will be lead to the best outcomes for our patients, both mentally and physically.